Hi class, my name is Mohammed Prince. This is my week seven discussion post. So um, my paper is covering public defense and the code of ethics for that. So it, it covers the lawyer client relationship, counselor, um, how the public defender acts as an advocate, um, as well as a counselor, transactions with, with persons other than clients, law firms and associations, public service, information about legal services, and um, how the public defenders task with maintaining the integrity of the profession, as well as the office they're working for. So compliance versus value-based training is another thing that I'm going to cover in my uh, final paper. Um, compli Compliance-based systems use legal terms, um, training, rules of conduct, and um, non-compliance penalties. And value-based systems um, rely more upon self-policing and motivation rather than coercion. So compliance is more um, legal and technical and it's more uh, organization or company based, whereas value based systems are, are more, you know, self policing and um, dealing with your own internal morals. So the theoretical frameworks that I'm going to cover in um, my final paper is uh, the natural law theory, and um, this is uh, where um, uh, Aquinas stated that, you know, the light of reason is placed by nature and um, by God in every man, um, which uh, is in turn guides them in their acts. Um, so therefore, human beings are um, among God's creatures. And we use reason to lead our lives. And that's natural law. So, um, and then Kant uh, describes category imperatives, categorical imperatives as commands or moral laws that all, all people have to follow regardless of their um, extenuating circumstances. Um, and because these are morals, these imperatives are binding upon everyone utilitarian utilitarian utilitarianism is um a form of consequentialism the general doctrine in eth in ethics um is that actions or types of actions should be evaluated based on their consequences contractarianism um argues that we're each motivated to accept morality um, because we're vulnerable to the depredations of others and because we can all benefit from cooperation with others. And um, Aristotle's virtue ethics is a, is a term for theories that emphasize the role of character and virtue in moral philosophy um, rather than doing rather than um, doing one's duty or acting in order to bring about good consequences. I just want to say thank you for watching and I look forward to seeing what you guys are uh, covering in your final paper as well.